so excited for you all to be here and meet my dear friend, Master Numerologist, Michelle Arbo. Hi. Knowing your numbers won't make you win a pageant, but will give some clarity into what's happening with their lives. I have some work to do, okay. but be very nice to her. I always see this in TV shows. There's some sort of like spiritual person that comes in, and I always think, is it scripted? Michelle is the real deal. You know, if you walk down the street and you say, what's astrology? Everybody says, oh, well, I'm a Leo or a Capricorn. Everybody knows what that is, right? But nobody knows what numerology is. They're like, what? what? What's numerology? And numerology is so accurate. It's a science. It's not metaphysical. So it's never wrong. It shows you who you really are, what you're here to do, and how you can accomplish it. Who wants to start first? <laughs> okay. I like astrology. I've never tried numerology. I'm excited. Okay, Nikita, what's your date for? 9-20-90-93. Wow. What? Girl, get out of your mind. <laughs> yes. You're an overthinker, overanalyzer, right? Yeah. Ooh, are you, like, reading my life right now? This is the most sensitive side of the chart. Yeah, you're very sensitive, but you're not vulnerable. So there's a lot of inner work you need to do. So yeah, that's you in a nutshell. I'm very frustrated already. It, it's very accurate. Very accurate, actually. So who's next? I go February 3rd, 1997. The 16-7 is like a really volatile interchange energy. It's like you start the year one way and you end it a completely different way. I love doing stuff like this. Like, I want to know what um, numerologists have to say about me or like fortune tellers. I'm very open-minded. You have the arrow of skepticism. You want all the facts first before you make up your mind. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. sure. That she does. <laughs> Alright, so what's your birthday? Uh, June 6, 666, 1993. A lot of those sixes and nines, yikes. See where you have this disconnect? Yeah, no soul. <laughs> it's actually the opposite. You're very hypersensitive, but no one would know this because she puts oh, the front. walls up. Ha, you have a facade too. But no, you really do. A lot of what she said about me, it really did hit me. I was like, oh my god, someone's really calling me out right now. Shall so, we move on to Jenny? Yeah. <laughs> 10, 24, 2002. Wow, you are sensitive. Oh, you're yeah, sensitive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Start listening. She said you're sensitive. She said, I'm oh, sensitive. You're, sensitive. You're, you're so sensitive, you're almost like remote viewer. Like that. Really? I mean, wow. That does not describe me literally at all. I'm the least sensitive person. I didn't cry during the notebook. I almost did, but I didn't cry. It's just like, wow. 